grime was the first time that I ever heard the word yo. And uh, I just thought, wow, you know, that's beautiful. <laughs> what is that, Italian? <laughs> Um, hello, my name's Tamsin. I'm originally from Cornwall, but I live in London now because I hate being happy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, uh, I'm Cornish and Irish, so I'm very exotic. I'm actually mixed white. <laughs> yeah. Double white, that's right. If there's pepper on my food, I'll start crying. <laughs> I grew up near Land's End. Um, and there wasn't really much around, so I moved to London because I really wanted to be closer to having a nervous breakdown. <laughs> um, I actually moved to London to be an actor, uh, but now I'm doing this, so obviously that's gone f***ing terribly. <laughs> People always do this thing where they lump Devon and Cornwall together, and like, I, no, they're completely different places, right? You know, like Cornwall has got two coastlines. Uh, Devon also has two coastlines, but everyone who lives there is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I really enjoyed saying that. <laughs> like in Cornwall, we do our cream teas correctly, you know, we do jam first. And in Devon, they marry livestock. So... <laughs> very different places, actually. Very, very different, yeah. Um, my family don't like me living in London. They don't like it. My brother came up to visit me recently. Never been to London. It was his first time. He refused to get on the tube. <laughs> Just wouldn't do it. And I was like, why won't you get on the underground? And he genuinely said, because Tamsin, too many Cornish died in the mines. <laughs> So we got an Uber, just like the miners would have wanted. <laughs> he said to me, uh, you know, Tamsin, you grew up on a council estate in Cornwall and you moved to a council estate in London. Why did you do that? And the truth is that I moved to London because I really like grime music. <laughs> Any fans of grime in? There's definitely not. <laughs> I do, I just, I really like it. I'd be in Penzance listening to grime music, right? And the lyrics would always be like, I've got loads of girls and I've got them in my bed. And I'd be thinking like, yeah, great, I need somewhere to stay. <laughs> Sounds good, <laughs> sign me up. I do, I really, I know, it's, um, I know it's a bit cringe me talking about grime music because I look like Davina McCall if she got a job at the range. <laughs> But I do just really like it. Um, if you don't know what grime... <laughs> that hurts, actually, now. <laughs> I'm going to keep talking about it. <laughs> um, if you don't know what a grime MC is, it's basically a rapper, but he won't take his coat off indoors. <laughs> Are you a grime MC? <laughs> I've never seen one that looks like you before. <laughs> um, I, uh, yeah, I just, I just really like it. I think it's great. Uh, grime was the first time that I ever heard the word yo. And uh, I just thought, wow, you know, that's beautiful. <laughs> what is that, Italian? <laughs> yeah, I'd like the fettuccine Alfredo and uh, the spaghetti yeah. <laughs> Can we get a side of for the table, please? Um, I love living in London now. I love living in the home of grime. Of course I do. Um, <laughs> look at me. Of course I love it. And um, I, uh, I've never lived anywhere else. Like I live, I've lived Land's End and I've lived in London and, and that's it. I've never really seen any other parts of the country until I started doing stand-up. And now I've been going more places for the first time. So um, I, I went to Wales for the first time recently. Um, and I didn't know anything about Wales. All I knew was that whole thing about, oh, you know, the Welsh shag sheep and... Whatever that is. Oh, awful rumour, isn't it? What an awful rumour <laughs> for there to be about a place. Terrible. And then I got to Wales. <laughs> and to be fair, 
The sheep are absolutely stunning. <laughs> I don't have any plans to have sex with a sheep. Um, just want to reassure you. I, I'm not very sexually adventurous, actually. I'm very, I'm very sexually boring. I know, what a waste. <laughs> no? No? Never mind. Thank, that's the applause, right? Thank you. Um, <laughs> I'm very sexually unadventurous, right? I'm just, I'm one of those people, right? If my friends ever got together and for my birthday, they got me one of those big cakes where a stripper pops out, I would just be thinking, oh, I see, there's no cake then. <laughs> I just feel like your sex life, your sex life, <laughs> she knows. <laughs> Your sex life is supposed to be exciting, like a roller coaster, but mine feels a bit more like I've got on one of those rickshaws in central London, <laughs> you know? Like, it seemed like a really good idea at the time, but now I just feel really bad for the guy. <laughs> the music's absolutely pumping, but it, <laughs> it just doesn't match the vibe. <laughs> He's down there, he's, he's working away really hard. I'm thinking, is it rude if I look at my phone? <laughs> it's not right, is it? Um, guys, it's been lovely. I've been Tamsin Kelly. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs>